figured I'd do a quick video update of uh, what I'm driving now since I got rid of the uh, Grand Marquis. I have my uh, Toyota Camry which I uh, got in 2004. It was fairly new. Had like 24,000 miles on it then. I've been driving it since 2006. It's got 101 with some change. I don't know how exact it is. Wires sticking out again. Ah, it's sticking out. Anyway, you get the idea. Got the New England Patriots logo or a sticker up there on the window. Our own university, Bass Pro Shops, and uh, one from Monticello in uh, Virginia. Front wheel drive, 2.2 liter uh, I-4. It's good on gas. It's got a uh, six speaker stereo, premium. I believe these are 14 inch wheels with uh, Toyota wheel covers on there. Got BF Goodridge um, touring tires, nitrogen filled. Yep, this car I took my driver's test in. Doesn't have a key fob. I've yet to have a car with one of those, but oh well. I have all Toyota, um, God, this thing's a mess right now. I've got all Toyota Camry floor mats, even though it's really dirty right now. I've seen my various summer trips to every place I still have, uh, or everywhere I have brochures and things for. Got my uh, Cobra 19 Ultra Dash 3. Get a better picture of that. CB radio, 40 channel, digital tuner. It's got the PA function and it also has a button for uh, normal operation or police and information channel. So it switches. God, it's hard to hold this thing. Yeah, there it is. It's one on the left. Switch between 9, which is police, 19, which is info, and normal operation. I currently have the antenna disconnected just because I'm working on different things, trying out different antennas. It's been in here for a long time. I'm just playing with things because it's, it's what I do. Right now I got my 9 foot um, coil loaded. It's actually one on the uh, top of the thing. It's usually in the bottom, but. That's actually like a uh, antenna that I built of a whole bunch of parts. The bottom base is from Walmart. I just hollowed it out and put the contacts in for a larger mast. I got a Radio Shack. And again, I mean, this thing's mast right now. I got like lunch bags and things. Here's another one of antennas. Got this one off like a 74 Jeep Cherokee in a junkyard. It's pretty cool. Got some uh, Kmart seats, fire extinguisher, some traction salt. Don't need that anymore. It's 80 degrees out, but ah, McDonald's, you know. Same old, same old. Got my uh, work gloves. And it does have the premium sound system and the premium stereo. It's just I took the stereo out. This one's from a chunker. This car was in an accident, like 2009. It's a really serious accident. So the front half of the car is a 97, while the rear half is a 99. This came out of the 97. The uh, guy at the junkyard, basic, or not the, uh, the, uh, whatchamacallit, auto shop that was fixing it over in Pittman said I can pretty much take anything I wanted out of the car because they were just going to crush it when they were done with it. So yeah, I took a whole bunch of stuff out, like cigarette lighters and knobs and buttons and things. I took the stereo too. This one's, it's very basic, you know. It doesn't have the, uh, seek or anything on the, the, uh, tape deck. Uh, it has Seek for uh, radio tuner, but 
Doesn't have any of the fancy tape deck features. Does have noise reduction though, which is nice. And you got your five only, or you're actually six channel presets for FM and six for AM. My other one had like two for FM and two for AM, and there was so many like presets. I think it went up to eight or something like that. It's in the trunk. I'll show you later. But I mean, it's a basic. You got your uh, typical logic control deck. I don't know what that means, but a little space to put sunglasses or uh, tapes or something. Uh, I got my tapes down there. It's got a uh, power port for your cell phone or uh, something plugged in there. I usually just use a cigarette lighter because it's easier. Like I said it's an automatic transmission. Four speed. Let's see how many miles this thing has on it. Introducing the Thunderbolt by HTC. 101597. Wiper wash, got pollen on the windshield. 